new here. Hi, what is going on? My name is Winnie, and if you're trying to find something cute to wear this summer, you should definitely consider subscribing. Plus size thrifting can be hard, but I am going to tell you guys how I personally thrift at the thrift store and find cute, trendy items for cheap. Don't look at the thrift store as a whole. When you do this, you tend to get easily overwhelmed. Instead, look at it in sections. What are the items of clothing that you like to find while thrifting? This brings me to my first thrift store finds, denim. I'm obsessed with Levi's, but sometimes it's really hard to find Levi's in my size. I cut these myself. These were definitely a DIY project. These are 550 Levi jeans. The waist on these is a 42 and the length is a 30. Because I already had the lighter denim, I wanted to get a darker denim short for summer. So I picked these 505 jeans up and I DIY them as well. Waist 40, length 40. 30. One thing that I'm obsessed with is skirts. We stop in the skirt sections. I love shopping for skirts. So, you know I gotta shop at the thrift store for skirts. You already know that. You know that's gonna happen. I found this really, uh, I love this skirt. I found this really cute vintage high-waisted skirt. It looks like it has Japanese flowers on it. That's what I'm thinking is on it. This skirt gets me just hype, okay? I get hype when I see this skirt. And it's vintage, and I got it for like $3. Next skirt that I found was this cute lime green tennis skirt. It's extremely stretchy. It has this cute black detailing down the sides. I just felt like it was something different. I liked the color, and I thought that it would look good on with maybe some cute tennis shoes. We can make anything work. I love going into lingerie because you can find really, really cute items there that honestly are so up to trend with today. I found this really cute nightgown slip dress. Of course, it's silky and has black stitching detailing on the top. It is kind of on the shorter side. You can tuck it in a pan, dress it up. No one would even know that you got it from the thrift store for like $3 and that it was a slip dress. So that's a win-win. This piece I'm most excited for, it's a vintage corset top. It has little hook uh, hooks right here in the center that you can hook up. It has these cute little stitched flowers all throughout the corset. I have been obsessed with this. Next section I always check out is tops. I always check out tops because you never know what you're gonna find. This top I picked up, it's this high neck striped t-shirt. It probably will come to a crop on me, I'm not 100% sure, or sit mid belly. But I really like this and I felt like I could have paired this with something really cute and maybe some denim, I don't know. We'll see how it goes. I love t-shirts like this that have random just um, pictures on them. This one has cute little flowers with some little birds sitting on it. I love the color and I cropped it myself and I feel like I just made it so much better. Sometimes I get a little carried away. This is one of those things. This was a cute little simple t-shirt that I thought I needed in my closet. This cute little bow right there in the center. It's a ribbed material. It comes up probably around mid belly button, which I thought was super cute. And I just like having simple t-shirts like this in my closet so I can pair them with you know, maybe something that's a little bit more extravagant, you know what I'm saying? The reason that I picked up this shirt is because I just like the colors, let's just be honest. And it just screamed summer. I probably unfastened the buttons for a more relaxed fit, but all in all, I feel like this was a good buy, and I think it was super cheap. I came across this really oversized, large, Scarf. It's so big that I can use it on my head and I can also wrap it around my body. I've seen a couple people do this and I think it's so cute. So when I saw this, I had to pick it up and I had to try it. I found this cute little beaded vintage bag. It opens like, uh, what are these bags called? I forgot. But I just really liked the whole beaded look. I feel like it was really vintage -y. Little bags have really been in for a good minute. Look at this little cute blue bag. It honestly looks like something a little kid would play with. We can use this for photo ops and we'll make the photo so much more cuter. And I only paid $1.99 for it. If you want to binge watch any more of my videos, I'll start you off with two right here. Chosen by me for you specifically. If you want to subscribe, do your thing. And I will see you in the next video. Bye.